hello guys so here let's start new series so here we are going to start grafna series so the first topic is grafna introduction so we need to understand what is grafna why we use grafna and the features and so on so let's start grafna introduction so in this session we are going to learn what is grafna then in grafna grafna oss grafna enterprise grafna cloud then why we use grafna features of grafna so let's start so firstly what is grafna so grafna is a free and open source visualization tool mostly used with prometheus to which monitor metrics and grafna provides various dashboards charts graphs alerts for the particular data source and grafna allows us to query visualize explore metrics and sets alert for the data source which can be a system server nodes cluster and etc and we can also create our own dynamic dashboard for visualization and monitoring and the and the main advantage of grafna is we can save the dashboard and we can share that dashboard with our team member that's the main and important advantage of grafna so that's the grafna then next is why we use grafna so grafna has pluggable data source model and comes built it with support for popular time series database like graphite it also has built in support for cloud monitoring vendors like amazon cloud watch microsoft azure and sql database like mysql and grafna can combine data from many places into a single dashboard and uh, companies use grafna to monitor their infrastructure and log analytics and they are improve their operational efficiency and dashboard makes tracking users and events easy as it automates the collection management and viewing of data so that's why we use grafna then next is features of grafna so here i mention some features so let's understand one by one so first is alerts so if you are using grafna alerting then you can have alerts sent through a number of different alert notifiers including page pager duty sms email twitter ops ops chain and slack so alert box allows you to create different notifiers with a bit of code if you prefer some other channel of communication visually define alert rules for your most important metrics the next feature is the feature is annotations so annotate grafna with rich event from different data sources and however over you know, event to see the full event metadata and tags and this features which shows up a graph makers in grafna and is useful for correcting data in case something goes wrong you can create the annotations manually just control click on a grafna sorry graph and input some text or you can fetch data from any data source then next feature is authentication grafna supports different authentication methods such as ldap and auth and allows you to map users to organizations and in grafna enterprises you can also map users to terms if your company has its own authentication system grafna allows you to map the terms in your internal system to term in grafna and that that's why you can automatically give people access to the dashboard designed for the teams then provisioning while it's easy to click drag and drop to create a single dashboard power users in need of many dashboard will want to automate the setup with a script and you can script anything in grafna for example if you are spinning up a new kubernetes cluster and you can also spin a grafna automatically with a script 
that would have the right server IP, server IP address and data source preset and locked in your users cannot change them. And it's also a way of getting control over a lot of dashboards. Then last and next is permission. When organization have a graph nine multiple terms, they often want the ability to both keep things separate and share dashboards. And you can create a team of users and then set permission on folders and dashboards and down to the data source level if you are using Rafna Enterprises. Okay, so that's the some Grafna features. Then next is Grafna OSS. So what is Grafna OSS? Grafna open source software. Grafna OSS full form Grafana open source software enables you to query, visualize alerts on and explore your metrics, logs and traces wherever they are stored. And Grafana OSS provides you with tool to turn your time series database, that means TSDB data into insightful graph and visualizations. After you have installed Grafna and set up your first dashboard using instructions in getting started with Grafna, you will have many options to choose from depending on your requirements. So that's the Grafna OSS. Next is Grafna Enterprise. Grafna Enterprise is a commercial edition of Grafna that includes additional features and not found in the open source version. Building on everything you already know and love about Grafna open source, Grafna Enterprise includes exclusive data source plugins and additional features. So let's understand the features of Grafna Enterprises. So here you can see Grafna Enterprises add following features. First is role-based access control to control access with role-based permission. Next is data source permission to restrict query access to specific term and users. Then data source query catch caching to temporarily store query result in Grafana to reduce data source load and rate limiting. Then reporting to generate a PDF report from any dashboard and set up a schedule to have it emailed to whomever you choose. Then export dashboard as PDF, then custom branding to custom Grafna from the brand and logo to the footer links, uses insight to understand how your Grafna instance is used, record queries to see trend over time for your data sources, then request security makes it possible to restrict outgoing requests from a Grafana server. And last, settings update at runtime allows you to update Grafana setting at runtime without requiring a restart. So that's the some Grafana enterprises, enterprise features. Then next is Grafana Cloud. So what is Grafana Cloud? Grafana Cloud is a highly available, fast, fully managed, open source logging and metric platform. It is very, sorry, it is everything you love about Grafana, hosted by Grafana Labs. And Grafana Cloud has get started with your free account with Grafana Cloud that includes a reverse free tier with access to 10K metrics, 50 GB logs, 50 GB trace, and two weeks data retention and three users. So that's the Grafana Cloud. So thank you. So that's the Grafana introduction. So that's the small introduction of Grafana. So here in this session, we have learned what is Grafana, Grafana OSS, Grafana Enterprise, Grafana Cloud, why use Grafana and some features of Grafana. So thank you for watching.